I don't have any regrets in life. Initially it was just like knee pain, growing pains and it was ache after I'd played football. My knees were extremely sensitive to touch and banging them on anything was extremely painful. Um, didn't really know what it was, brushed it off for a couple of years, just played through it. Then as, as I started like really growing, it um, was affecting me more and more and I had to eventually, it got so bad that I had to stop playing football for a full year so I missed the whole season which was hard. And then coming back into it after was also quite difficult as well because I didn't really know how much everybody else would have progressed around me. I was unable to go back to the team I wanted to uh, because I'd been replaced in that year and stuff like that. When I had my injury and I started seeing loads of different physios and doctors and stuff to try and figure out what it was and how I could treat it, I was becoming intrigued as well to try and find out uh, my own injury. Um, and so that side of sport I never really looked into it was then presented in front of me, forced, forced upon me, and I started realising that it was quite interesting to me. In final year sports therapy, which is um, what I'm in now, um, the students all have to run the on-campus clinic, uh, which has actual patients, we run it all throughout the week, and anyone can come in um, and talk to us about their injuries and then we all go through a protocol that we've learned of how to treat, not specifically diagnose, but treat um, injuries with, under the guidance of uh, our lecturers and people like that. So we see patients every week, we get them to come back, um, new patients all the time, it's gotten busier over the year. And as you're obviously treating people week after week after week, you kind of like build a rapport with them, so you can get to know them on a personal level as well and seeing the effort that they put in and knowing the effort that you've put in to helping them as well, when they finally are able to go back into sport injury free, it's really good to see. Yeah, it's nice. Having played sport a lot more than I've treated injuries and now I'm in the area in which I'm treating injuries and seeing sport all the time is kind of a bit, makes you wish you were um, still involved in that or more involved in that um, than you are currently. But also it is um, an opportunity to be part of sports still, whereas otherwise I might not even be part of sport at all. Before I started doing sports therapy I've had my injury and I've seen other injuries as well and I've seen how it can ruin careers not only at an elite level but at um, like a grassroots level as well. And some people even like fall out of love with the sport as well because of it. And being able to help people resolve their injuries before that happens to them is something I personally find satisfying.